think about how it feels when you um, cannot really pay for that amazing thing that your daughter or son wants. Maybe that toy they, that they want to buy, which is expensive according to you, in your opinion. Or maybe your wife wants to buy that amazing dress. You know she will look great in that. And she wants to get it and wear that and really enjoy that dress. She fancies wearing it. And you want her to get that dress, but you can't buy it because it's beyond your current budget. Think about how it feels. Think about how it feels when you know deep inside your heart that you want to provide the best education for your children. And in your current reality, you are providing the best education in your budget. But you know that your children deserve more. Maybe a better tutors, maybe more um, powerful environment in the school. And you have some ideas about the schools and the colleges that your children can go to, but you cannot afford it right now. How it feels. Think about it. Think about it how it feels when you have house loan and the car payments and that loan and the personal loan to pay off and you don't know how exactly to end it and when it will end and it constantly bothers you in your mind and you just want to get out of this financial stress struggle and sacrifice probably it's been more than six months you haven't bought something exceptionally well for yourself there is a car of that friend that you want to buy new but you keep looking at the car of the friend and someday you feel one day I will buy but you keep driving that same old shitty broken dumbass car because you cannot afford your dream car. Tell me, does that relate to you a bit? I can tell you from my personal experience that things don't get, her, things don't get better by itself. You have to make it better. So the reality is that if you find yourself in a situation where affording better things are becoming harder and harder for you each day, isn't it time that you give yourself permission to be financially wealthy? Isn't it time that you finally give yourself allowance to enjoy the better things in life? Isn't it time that you stopped booking those cheap flights on that site and started enjoying vacation like the king? Isn't it time that you stopped worrying about the financial debt and the stressful situation about the loan and you just really paid off all this, hand off your dust, help your friends, help your community, send your children to the best school in the world isn't it time man because i can tell you right now after waking up in the morning if you don't have a sense of confidence in your own ability to provide the best for your family best for your children best for your community best for your organization then you are living a fearful life if you wake up and start worrying about every single day, oh my God, I have to meet that person, oh my God, I have to make that phone call, oh my God, I have to pay off that loan, how do I get that money? There is too much month left at the end of the money. There is a better life waiting for you. And it starts with you making a decision that enough is enough. I don't want to live like this anymore. I don't want to live like an average person anymore. This is my current reality, but the, this does not have to be my ideal future I can live a better life and if you know my story you know many years ago I found myself in a situation just like this but I did not have money I did not have motivation I did not have a purpose I did not have power I did not have time I was working like a dog and still I was not making big things happen i was just paying my bills the electric bill the gas bill the the food the grocery and i was not left with any money for myself i didn't have luxury 
but I made a decision to change my life. I made a decision to improve my future. I made a decision to live from the heart in a powerful manner so that I could save more money, invest in myself, invest in my own confidence, invest in my education, provide the best for my family, get them the dress that they want, get them the vacations that they want. And when I, when I today, when I go for a vacation, I don't look for the, I don't look for the cheap flights. I look for the best views. When I book a hotel, I don't go to Google and type cheap hotels in this and this. The best. Because you get to live life only once, my friend. You don't live your life over and over again. It's one-time opportunity for yourself. So look at your life and ask yourself, am I living my life in the best possible way? And if the answer you get is no, that's good. Thank you for this honesty. I admire you for that. And that's an opportunity for you, isn't it? For you to look at and ask yourself, how can I live a better life? Because I can tell you something. If you want to live a quality life, you have to hang out with quality people. So audit your inner circle and ask yourself, do I have in my inner circle, okay? Do I have people that are living the life that I want to live? If the answer is no, that's probably the reason you're not living your dream life because you don't have the right people in your circle you don't have the right mindset you wake up fearful instead of waking up powerful when you wake up with gratitude every single morning and that will happen when you have enough abundance in your heart enough confidence in your soul and enough happiness in your in your life things start to really really fast really change really really fast and once I started learning from the right mentors right coaches the word is right not any coach any mentor right mentors and right coaches who are constantly challenging me critiquing me without judgment they were holding me accountable I started improving in my health in my mindset, in my feeling, in my finances, in my fulfillment, in my family life. And people were like, wow, how did you do this? I did this by following the right system. So I encourage you to find the right people in your life. People who challenge you to book the best flights. People who show you the way toward your freedom. Without judgment, with total accountability. I want you to find people who really invite you to a better life. People who, when you go to their children's birthday party, you feel inspired. Not by just seeing how much money they are spending, but you're inspired by the environment. There is no show off. There is just celebration. You know what I mean? When you go to meet those friends and these colleagues, they don't make you feel weak, they make you feel inspired. I have people like this in my life, a lot. People who constantly invite me to a greater future. People who constantly invite me to a better lifestyle. And whenever I hang out with them, I feel, oh my God, there is so much more possible for me if I just let myself get that allowance from within to live a better life with more fulfillment without any judgment and that's when I started waking up in the morning with a power that's when I started living my life with purpose that's when I started going to sleep at night with peace the same thing is possible for you right there I'm talking to you now and if you have not been living that amazingly powerful fucking life, I invite you to live one. And it starts with a decision. That's when you can send your children to the best schools in the world. Not the best you can afford, but the best there is. That's when you no more have to buy those cheap flights anymore. You can get the best seats. That's when you go, can go for the best vacations and enjoy powerful alignment with your partner right there. And enjoy. Not, for just, not just for showing photos on Facebook, 
you won't facebook won't even know how much of power you felt in that vacation and i want you to live a powerful life i want you to join the army the club the brotherhood the manhood for living the confident life i want to see you soon in the club my name is bishal sarkar always reminding you that public speaking is not about perfection it's all about connection